Brian, there are two key words in the Common Core battle, conform and control. Frankly, I think they're both scary because uniform standards usually don't work in education and control is a troubling word no matter what the subject matter is. And I said earlier in the program today that Common Core proponents want a nationalized, uniform style of education. All kids will learn the same content. What do you think is wrong with that? Well, that just becomes a giant propaganda machine for whatever worldview the government yes. wants impressionable young Americans to believe, and that's exceedingly dangerous. I mean, it would be dangerous at any time in our history, but particularly dangerous when you have the kind of administration that we have right now that has a fundamentally uh, anti-American, a uh, fundamental view that's hostile toward Christianity and toward Judeo-Christian values. You know, I think it was Abraham Lincoln that said back in his day that the philosophy of the schoolroom is the philosophy in one generation, is the philosophy of the government in the next generation. In other words, everybody has understood that what schools are intended to be is to be a place where citizens can be trained, they can be educated, Mm -hmm. they can be educated in history, geography, they can learn to read and write so they can think for themselves and know how to express themselves so that they can become fully participating members of a culture and a society and be educated. It was interesting. I remember reading a a quote in Time magazine back in 1972, and it struck me. It stood out to me. I've never forgotten it because I thought, thank God that will never happen in America. Mm -hmm. And it turns out I was wrong because here we are in 2014, and exactly what happened in Russia is happening now. What this Russian scholar said, he was a historian, and he said, the thing you have to understand about Russia is that it is impossible to predict the past. And what he meant by that is every new regime comes in and they completely rewrite Russian history to make everybody that came before them look like the bad guys mm-hmm. and then make them look mm-hmm. like uh, the saviors of, of Russian culture and all that. Well, we're, we're exactly in that same place right now where it's becoming impossible to, to predict America's past because of the way it has been retooled and refashioned in curriculum. And the worst thing that we could have, that we could do, is to give total control over what kind of curriculum is taught, whether it's math or whether it's literature, and particularly history, to give that over to a federal government and to federal government uh, bureaucrats that are fundamentally hostile to America as it was founded. And that's what we have with Common Core. 